Miami Speedway, Predixie Vodka 400. So many drivers here today competing in this racetrack. I'm not going to count how many are because it's usual field as usual. But only one nail still wins today. Before we get into the race, let's have to take a look at Drive Vodka before we start this race off. Starts on the pole this will be 18 of Kyle Bush with a fast qualifying lap, puts him on the pole. He won this race back in season one, can he do it again? Kyle Bush got the pole, but Chase Briscoe was fast in practice, so look at that 14 car today. It has a lot of power in that 14 engine. And if we, not, we cannot talk about constantly about the finish we had here last season in season number three, well, hopefully, but whatever, between Tyler Reddick and Chase Elliott, by Elliott just getting the edge over Reddick. Can Reddick get his redemption today? Or can Elliott defend his ridden here at Helmstead? I want to remain the corner fight up front of Austin Dillon and Eric and Roller. Let's see what they can do today here at, up front. Maybe we can for a win. And they haven't won in ages. Well, apparently for Austin, I guess. Because they haven't been seen them. Well, you won in last, last year, but whatever. Along with the good qualifiers, there were the bad qualifiers. Joey the guy around Blaine Steve start deep in the field today. Not what they wanted to start, so they have a lot of ground to make up. They want to contend for this win. That also does include Denny Hamlet as well. He also starts real deep in the field today. So outside the top 20, that is not like Denny Hamlet fan, Denny Ham fan so, but he can make a lot of ground up. But I don't know, he wasn't really fast in practice at all. Not, not even close, so got a lot to do if he wants to get a contend for this win. But now, let's go track side. Command the fire engines, please welcome Mickey Movie. And now, for the most famous words in all of motorsports. And as you begin to fire up here at Hornsdale, we'll take a look at the starting lineup. So in row one, you have the 18 of Kyle Bush and the 5 of Young Money, Kyle Larson. In row two, you have last race winner, Christopher Bell and Chase Briscoe. In row three, you have Tyler Reddick and Chase Leonto. In row four, you have two veterans of the sport, the 4 of Happy Harvick and the 45 of Kurt Busch. Right in the top 10 in row 5, you have the 61 of Cameron Perkins and the 3 of the ace, Austin Dillon. In row 6, you have the 10 of Eric and Rowley. And the 24 of Woodley Byron. In row 7, you have 48 to the Bowman, the Hack Sherman. And the 19 of Stereo's winner, MTJ. In row 8, you have the 2 of Daytona 500 champ, Austin Sendrick. And the 1 of Ross Chastain, Wolverine Kids. In row 9, you have the 6 of Big Brad Bird, Kislowski. And the 43 of Eric Jones. Right now, top 20 in row 10, you have 99 of Mexican Boy himself, Daniel Swerver, name's Danny Brew. And the 22 of Go Go Gotta! In row 11, you have the 12 of YRB, Ryan Blaney, and the 41 of Custard Cream. In row 12, you have the 42 of Evan's favorite driver, Ty Dillon, and the 17 of Chris Bush. In row 13, you have the of Denny Hammer and Hamster, and the 23 of 24 Lemons driver himself, Bubba Warren. In row 14, you have the 34 of Michael McDale, and the 47 of Ricky Spinhouse Jr. In row 15, you have the two rookies, Harrison Burden and Todd Rillins. In row 16, the 7 of Corey Joy Joy, and the 31 of Justin Haley. In row 17, we have the 15 of Garrett Smithley, and the 16, making this return back to the disc from Cut Series competition, Daniel Hemrick. And right at the field in row 18, we have the 51 of everyone's least favorite driver, Cody Ware, and the 77 of Josh Blinky. And now, here you race back to these race, the big fan six drivers, 8 laps, 0 in terms of rain, that's always usual. Car was on pole for this, number four. Chase Elliott winning this race in season number three, and as the recent winner hit the track, can he defend that win, as I said before? And we're ready to get this race started. Green flag in the air here at Hunstead. Lads, we've got a lot of action now going on. Chase Briscoe now to the lead, last and second, Reddick third, through turn three and four. Last on the outside, try and make out the delay work, will, will not work. Briscoe will lead, let number one. Briscoe, how about that? Him up front, don't see that often in this series. Over turn two, Briscoe continues to lead. Do the other drivers run his back tail as they come through turn three, four? Briscoe will lead off turn number four. Lead number three, short on turn two. Austin Dillon gets turned in the inside wall hard. And here's replay off instant here. Come through turn uh, turn two. Austin looks like he just got loose off turn number two and could not save it. And goes to the inside wall. Really hard hit for that three car. That will take him out of competition. Tough break for him. Now watch Ryan Blaney quickly. Kim, he's on the other side. Barely misses Austin Dillon, who slides down his lane. Lucky for him. So Austin Dillon is on the hook. His day is sadly done. So tough break for him. Looks to have a good car today after qualifying side top ten, but it just wasn't meant to be for him. But it is meant to be for Chase Briscoe, leading the race right now, looking to win the race. We're gonna reach on that four of eight, and he is currently a race leader, last in the hot pursuit in second though.
Green flag, back out on Hill at 4 of uh, 8. Treat Brisket to the lead. Larson, though, is not giving up on the outside. Side by side to the lead. Off the turn four. Larson kids Briscoe and will leave that number four. And here is the replay. Tyler Reddit, the race leg gets read by Kyle Larson. Larson overdrove turn number four. Gets in the Reddick high into the inside wall for Tyler Reddick. That is the guy for the A team. Tough, tough break for them. It's a tough break for them. Now I can't really tell if Larson did that on purpose or he just didn't check it right. Whatever the case is, Tyler Reddick's day is done. And the fans are not happy at all with Kyle Larson. If they come, he comes across the line now, they are booing Larson right now. Being serious right now. And for the second time at Hunston, Tyler Eck comes so close to winning it. Two laps away, but gets turned. Tough break for him. I'm just racing as a whole, so not a great day for that team at all. And it makes me exciting for Hendrick for Rich George Racing fans as well. I'm Reddick fans to be exact. Larson continues to lead. Can he win this race with two laps to go? We'll have to wait and see. Green flag in here, two laps to go here at Elmstead. Lost and Elliot lead the field. Elliot's up high, and here comes Perkins out of nowhere. But Alex Bowman out of nowhere. Here he comes, the hack, but Elliot right beside it last once again. Here they come, white flag in the air. Here they come, three turn for fun. So Elliot makes the slide jump, does not work, but he does take the lead. Down the badge for the final time. Elliot Brooks, big crash, four cars, five cars in both. Front straight, here they come, I don't even know, was that half it? So much stuff happening on the final lap. Here's the final lap crash here. Kurt Busch got loose on the rough track scene. Armad nowhere to go. Sendrick had nowhere to go. Both pile into the outside wall. A lot of smoke. Probably some flames. Come down the infill. Looks like a side to go involved. Massive, massive pile up. And here is the finish. I lost my brain about that wreck. I did not know how this finish went. Let it put laps on the wall. And then Kevin Harvick coming out of nowhere and steals it. What a finish. Here's that wreck again. I did see it on the front straight. Um, Kurt made fun of the then. And here was the final lap in full speed. Big, big crash in turn 102. And a fantastic finish. The closer celebrates here at Hornstead. And now Harvick comes across the line. And two's the burn out here at Hornstead. This victory is built by Sunoco. Do your best. Let's go down, down there to see our race winner, closer Kevin Alvin. So as Kevin Alvin salutes the fans here at Homestead, a massive pile up and turn number two, one and two. All drivers are playing the cars and all right. That includes Koslowski, Kurt Busch, Ross Justine, Austin Senek, and Eric Amarola, who was who actually made his group ever down, but he's got to climb his car. Jones was also involved in the wreck, but he managed to finish the race, so good for him. So he's lucky. Anyway, let's take a look at himself today's race. And here we are from today's race. Kevin Alvick, your race winner. Chase Elliott, Kyle Larson, Alex Bond and Willem Byrne, all Henrik boys from the second, third and fourth. And fifth. Tough break for them. And Henrik fans as well. Because, well, that kind of sucks that all four Henrik cars finished behind one two of racing cars. It kind of sucks. Ryan Blaney bounced back to go sixth place finish. Cameron Perkins, quiet day seventh. Kyle Bush did absolutely nothing from the path, and it's 8th, so he, he was in top 10 at least all day. Jordan Garner as well rebound again, nice we finish, and Ty Dillon somehow got top 10. Any equipment he puts him in, screw it, he'll win a row, he'll get a top 10, so yeah. Don't know if won 11th place, good for him. Drake is racing, struggled all day. Truex 12th, Howard 13th, Kyle, Drake Chris was about 14th, not a great day for them. Miami Nelson's not going to top 15 there, nice job for him. Another finish as well, Chase Briscoe got loose in that final restart, he made a great day, but... Yeah, he put a 17. Tough break for him. Call the Joy got 20th. Nice job for him. And then Cody Webb, 28th. So that's what Cody Webb does best. So, yeah. Every Jones again, last class finished the race. And everyone else fell on DNF, including both Roger Racing cars. Not a great day for them at all. Thanks, guys. That'll cap it off here at Hunter Miami Speedway. Congratulations to 
congratulations to Kevin Harvick and one more cup series who signed up for Kevin Harvick for winning today's race. So, great job to Harvick. That's his fifth for us here's cup series win. Surprisingly, he has more wins than Matt Benedetto does. And yeah, I have, I like more, I like Matt more than him. I, I don't know, don't ask. Anyway, that's it for me. Make like, subscribe, leave a comment below, and I'll see you guys whenever. This is me, CSC Fun Rose Network. So, now, great, that's to Kevin Harvick and one more cup series on their victory here today.